Hi guys, this is Omer from MMOHut.com and I'm doing a quick gameplay video for KOS Secret Operations, a 3D tactical MMO FPS published by a company called Don't Blink. Don't, now I'll spend about 10 to 15 minutes running around checking this game out, make some comments. If you guys want to play KOS Secret Operations or just learn more about it, do check out the full review on the link below. So let's go ahead and get started over here. Now this is a quick gameplay video I want to do for KOS because I'm... I like to try random FPS games every now and then. I've done this for several games now, including Combat Arms and several other titles. But for now, let's just go ahead and get started now. The server right now is called Optimo. Let's go ahead and join this over here now. Again, this is by KOS Secret Operations, which actually makes Mech Tech over there, which is a uh, CBT Phase 2 coming soon. Let's go ahead and play on Channel 1 because it's normal. We like to play with normal people on normal channels. So let's go ahead and hop on over here. Now, this is an MOFPS game, as I said, but I know it's not very popular. And it's a game I really haven't played that much since it originally released back in, like, sometime early last year in uh, early 2010. But anyway, let's go ahead and join a random game over here. I have pretty much a starting weapon over here, and again, my kill deaths 482 to 281. Not so bad, you know, not that bad. But for now, let's join a team deathmatch style map because I like playing team deathmatch. And they got one out of 30, so it looks like up to 30 players per map, which is kind of cool. But let's organize by most players over here, and 8 out of 30 is the best one right now. So let's go play Dine in Hell, and let's click Ready Up over here and play. Now again, I haven't played this game in forever, so I probably forgot. I mean, you can't really forget the basics in an MMO FPS. I mean, you point the crosshair at the enemy, and you shoot. But let's see how I do right now. Uh, there's a little pipe over there I can crawl into over there and camp over there. Uh, I'm not sure, Delta map over here, and it's a team deathmatch. In King of the Hill, I'm not sure why it's telling me about King of the Hill and deathmatch over here, TDM. Anyway, let's go ahead and wait for the loading screen to finish up over here. Now, I'm actually not even sure what KOS actually stands for. Could be Kill on Sight, because I know Kill on Sight is from EverQuest, but uh, it, actually, it could be Kill on Sight. I might have read somewhere it is Kill on Sight. And there we go, it actually loaded. There are many advantages in playing something. So, Kill on Sight, there you go, KOS. Uh, I think that's what it means. Anyway, my team over here, it's a Team Deathmatch style game, and uh, there are bots in the game as well. There's a few AIs on the enemy team, but it's a mostly uh, players in the actual game. So it looks like you can actually play with bots if you want as well. Can we run? Uh, shift? Nope. Can we double tap to run? Control? Nope. Alt? There might be a way to run. I imagine there is, but if we see somebody else running, we'll know what's up. That guy's a rookie AI. Let's go follow him. Hopefully, he'll take some bullets for me, you know? He'll hold aggro. Let's see how he does. Oh, he's holding aggro over there, but nobody's shooting back at him. Oh man, that guy's invulnerable. He just rezzed up. Oh, pull my grenade over here, my frag grenade. Throw that up. Uh, I feel like there's a little bit of lag throwing that grenade, but you know what? It doesn't really matter. Let's go. Let's go be ballsy and run into their base. Now I probably shouldn't be running towards their base because the thing about games like this is there's almost always a respawn time where if you respawn, you're pretty much invulnerable for a few seconds. Got that guy over there, but you can't kill somebody the second they rest, which is kind of unfortunate because I like camping in enemy bases as much as I like to do. But in this game and most MOFPS games, you can't really do that because if you do that, you're just gonna die. The guys are being invulnerable, and you won't be able to kill them. So let's uh, let's keep chillaxing over here. It looks like my team is winning quite candidly. Oh yo 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 yo! I got killed by a uh, sandbag AI. How did an AI named Sandbag end up killing me? Now it seems like uh, only two, two AIs on the, three AIs on their team, and we got a few on my team as well. I kind of wish they just get rid of the AIs because I'd rather play with actual players. But as you can see from the lobby, the game really isn't that popular because first of all, there's AIs and AIs, AIs in this game too, and uh, this was the most crowded room in the game with eight players in it right now, eight actual players, maybe a bit more now that I actually joined. But let's see. Again, my team is winning handedly. That Pershing guy over there's got like three kills in a row. I'm gonna go camp over here like an a-hole, and hopefully uh, they'll come out. Uh, they, I'll camp out the AIs. There's so many guys just camping there. I don't want to. Oh my god, this dude over there. I don't want to look at him. And let's go back over here again. I really don't want to go in there because I'm just gonna die. But you know what? You know what, guys? Oh my god, I'm just gonna go in. Be a ballsy man and go and kill these two guys. Oh yeah, boo yeah, two kills. Let's get this guy over here. Oh my god, there you go, three kills. Get that. I probably killed all AIs though, so I really shouldn't feel too good about that. I killed Golden Sword X D X X X, whatever his name is. And if you notice, if you put X X's in your name, it's like the most common thing in the world. If your name is taken, just surround it by X's, you know, like X X Remo X X. And you know what? It'll be available. So let's put my knife over here. And as you guys know, you always run faster with a knife. I think since Counter Strike started doing that, and every game started copying it, you shoot that a hole over there. And I'm not sure why he's an a hole, but oh my god, I didn't get the kill. And this sandbag AI just sniped me again. He's got two kills on me so far. So at least half my deaths are from that one AI. No, more than half my deaths. He's killed me two times out of three times. So apparently I'm killing players but dying to AIs. Go me. So let's pull up my knife again and run across the map. I'll, I'll probably switch maps real soon because I want to play with more actual players than actual AIs. Though I remember playing this earlier, I did quite well because uh, it's actually really easy to play. If you've played any FPS game, you can be able to figure this out. Go shoot that guy with my pistol. And that was an actual player. Go me. Another guy over there. Oh my god, I got killed by XX Golden sword xx whatever his name is i'm not sure no it's not a headshot he shot me in the body over there and it's kind of cool actually it tells you exactly where you die from that guy died in the foot shot on the top right private timmy killed somebody yeah it tells you where you die your body shot headshot leg shot arm shot 
Which I guess is actually kind of helpful. But let's go respawn over here. You know what, guys? I'm gonna play for legit right now. Because this guy... Oh, I, I was totally JKing about the for legit. But I love when you do really poorly and you start... Oh, why, why is that chicken or bra? I don't know. It was kind of random. In a, in a technical FPS game, you know. Everybody else in, like, heavy armor. But that avatar, for some reason, has, like, no shirt on. Makes no sense. But you know what? I'm not gonna question it. And we got my rookie AI over here. We should, oh, there's a guy right there. Let's kill you. Oh, man. Enemy down. Anyway, I'm gonna go try for legit right now. And that's the best thing to say, you know, when you start losing, you're like, alright guys, I'll play for real this time. Because before then, you know, you weren't playing for real, I mean, you were, you were just kind of playing. But now, guys, I'm playing for legits. Uh, that nature would have, should have killed somebody, I guess the guy in there died already. And he's on my team, why am I trying to shoot him? I probably shouldn't be doing that, because I'm a nice guy. Let's go under over here. I'm, oh my god, what am I doing under this pipe? There you go, killed the same guy twice, death brand. Second time I killed him, I wish oh, that's my teammate over there too. I really gotta stop doing that, but it's so tempting. I mean, it takes longer for me to check that they're on my team than just shooting at them. So you know what? I might as well make sure. You know what? I'm going to go in their base again. Even though they just respawned here and that person's going to die. going to get you too. Oh man, I missed so many times. Oh my god, you a-hole just chaos me. Alright, let's go. Uh, let's not do that again. I'm done. Oh, I just died right there. And it tells you at the bottom right over there your battle info. Again, you know, how much damage you did to which players and stuff like that. Which I think is pretty helpful. I did, what is it, 256 out of 53 HP to that dude. And I'm not sure what, the, like, what exactly is going on down there. We got a little map as well. Can we click tab? Nope. You can see a map on the top left always. It kind of floats over there. Fire in the hole! That's like an angry fire in the hole when you shoot your grenade. Oh my god, this dude right there. And I was reloading like, uh, like a little nub over there. One thing I've noticed I do in a lot of FPS games, I reload prematurely. Like, even when I don't need to, like, I use, like, three bullets, I'll go ahead and reload. Just because, I don't know why I do that, but I do do it. And then when somebody kills me, I get so mad, because I was just reloading for no reason. Oh, I just died again. My score is not that bad, though. 11 and 7. The rookie AI over there, that rookie AI ain't no rookie. He's 21 and 8. He's a boss. He's, he's the best one on our team. That AI is carrying us to victory. But, uh, yeah, you see the score up there, 95 to 81. And it comes down to whoever has the most kills in 20, what is it, 22 minutes. So this guy should take a while. So, again, this death, I will leave after this round. Let's go kill that guy. Oh, man, there's another dude over there. There you go. Just kill two. Oh, man, there's a guy shooting at me, but he's missing. And he got me. Death brand over there. Let's go ahead and leave this match and try joining another one. The game is money. It's called Crones. And again, this game did launch in early 2010, but it's not that popular. But you know what? If you look for a random FPS game to play, why not give KOS Secret Operation to try? Pro mode. You know what? Every time I play, I'm always playing in pro mode. Let's go leave this over here. I can probably get a different weapon to it because this starting weapon is probably pretty gimp. So every time I died, it was because I was using the starting weapon. If I was using a different weapon, I would have just owned everyone. Let's go to a shop over here. Check it. Oh, we got a golden M4A1. It probably costs cash out monies. And it's probably OP, but let's find out. Nope, it does cost cash over there. Are there any weapons that don't take cash? I imagine there is. I got dig through over here. Yep, that one requires just crones over here. I'm using K2, which is trading, which is pretty bad. I got enough crones to buy this weapon, and it lasts one day. I mean... I'm so angry at these FPS games because always the weapons don't last forever. Very few games, and I think only like one or two games where the weapons are permanent. So I can't even buy this for one day. I got, I got, I got dough. Why can't I buy this? Uh, nope, my rank requirement is not met, so I can't, I can't quite use that at my current low level right now. So you know what? Let's stick with my newbie weapon and let's go join a different map again. And let's go back over here, organize my most players, and again, Subway. I'll play some Subway over here. And oh my God, there's all AIs on the enemy team. You know what? I'll play with AIs. I like killing AIs. I gotta get my KDR up. You know. It'd be kind of cool if the game had a bigger player base, but not so much. I think right now the most popular MOFPS game is still Combat Arms, but that really shouldn't be too surprising. That game is mega packed. Crazy aces over here. And this is also by a company called Don't Blink. Uh, that game, I don't think it's out yet or, any or anywhere near release as I'm doing this video at least. Road to India. That's kind of random over there. So I guess, are we in India right now? Oh, Rohan Online. Ronelia. Dungeon open right now. It's kind of cool they promote these random games on their... On their Oh, there's a dude right there who's not on my team. Good thing, uh, this guy over here, uh, Sandbag, yeah, he's, he knows what's up. He got him for me. Uh, let's see. Let's see where we can go. Yeah, there's a lot of guys on the enemy team. Mostly AI, so I should do all right. And if I do poorly, that's going to kind of suck. Oh, dude, dude right there. Let's go kill him. I, I, I killed Dexter over there. Dexter's lad. We're going in. Oh, man. Kill that guy over there. Triple kill. Twice. There you go. I kept missing that guy for some reason, though. Of course, I'm playing with my monitor turned off, guys. Every time My monitor is obviously off, so I'm going to turn it on right now and play for legit. Oh, I just died over there, so I shouldn't have said that. So, <laughs> let's see my score right now. I'm th I'm 3-1. Mostly against, I think killed an AI or two that round. My ping is 108. PNG. I like how they abbreviate it. It's one letter. They really need to get rid of that one letter. It's called PNG now instead of P-I-N-G. But you know what, guys? Pull up my knife again, and let's go slash some people. I'm not sure what this is. I'm oh, dude, this guy right there. Oh, man. Oh, blah, blah, blah. 
Oh man, if I got a double kill there, that would've been pretty clutch. But I'm playing very, very ballsy, but it's fun to do sometimes too. Though I think the only real, you know, FPS games you, you can really play ballsy and, you know, just go crazy. Not even think about just rush up as Quake. Quake Live, that is. And it's not really an MMO again, it's really an FPS, but... Wow, that guy did Sandbag AI. I'm telling you, that guy owned the last game. What's his score of this game? He's 18 and 24. So, uh, Rookie AI, on the other hand, he's positive. He's 32 and 22. So, the AI is not awful, but the fact that you can play with AI is, I guess, a little nifty feature. Because now, let's go pick up a different gun. I want to I want to take this gun over there. G drops the gun, much like in Counter Strike 2. I think Counter Strike and Half Life were the first few games to use that hockey, you know, to drop weapons. So, let's, there's, there's, there's gunfire out here. So, let's, you know, let's pay attention. All right, guys, we're going we're gonna to go own it up right now. So let's see. And of course, controls wise, WSAD. I don't want to go through all the basics again. Again, because it's in that. Man, this gun stinks. But you know what? I brought lava down over there. I killed that guy right now. Oh man, this guy. Jump up and down. And my pro juking did not quite work well as I want as I wanted it to. But my score is still positive, so I'm kind of happy. I kind of wish more people did play the game because I mean, playing against AIs is, is kind of weird. But as I'm recording this video, it's like eight in the morning, so it's a really awkward time. I'm not sure, again, I'm not sure what these ads are for, some like Korean dramas or J-dramas. Uh, I think this game is made in Korea because most, you know, MMF, most free-to-play MMOs are made in Korea. Uh, the starting weapon is not that bad. I kind of like it more than the weapon I just picked up. Yep, you have three seconds of vulnerability when you res. And the thing with FPS games is, I've said this before, I'm going to say it again, you get bored of an FPS game if you keep playing the same one. No matter how much you actually like it. I remember, I, I mean, I, I go through like... I'll have a period of time where I'll just keep playing ABA, and I'll get bored out of it, I'll, I'll get burnt out of it, and I'll go back to like S4 League, I'll play that for a while, and then I'll, I'll just play random games, I played Mission Against Terror the other day, I did really well, but I, just playing through random FPS games is kind of fun sometimes, and it's pretty easy to do considering there are so many free-to-play MOs out there, especially MO FPS games, and I, man, I, am, I am off my game right now, guys, I am, uh, I am, I am 5 and 6, I am negative against these AIs, I'm playing mostly against AIs and I'm negative, that is pretty awful, but you know what, I'm gonna redeem myself this round, this round is the round, so let's see how I do right now, no randomly switching weapons, no matter how tempting it is, I'm doing it right now, click Q to switch weapons, how many of you guys do that, just randomly switch weapons in FPS game, see, I was randomly switching weapons and I couldn't kill that guy, he was out of my pistol equip, and let's go take that kill over there, oh man, totally stole your kill over there dude, uh, I'm sorry Mr. Black, I'm shooting you in the back to uh, say, say I'm sorry, but let's go up these stairs. What, what, where am I going right now? This is a pretty small map, but I'm getting lost already. Let's go climb uh, climb this way, because it seems more fun. And the map is kind of small, too, so it is pretty high action-y. I guess we got to go this way. Let's go kill... Again, I'm even right. Oh, oh why am I getting shot from? That a-hole. That guy was camping over there, and lava... I just killed that guy, and lava killed me this time. He, he got his revenge back. Uh, I'm going to go even one more kill, and then I'll try swapping maps again. To keep things up. I think the last one had more players anyway, so I should have stuck with that one. But uh, this one ends in seven. Oh man, this guy right there. Can we knife him? Can we knife him? Oh, I got killed by Legend Land. Almost knifed him though. The problem was I was left clicking instead of right clicking. I think right click is a stab, left click is a slash. In every other FPS game, it's like that, so let's test that right now anyway. Left click is. Right click is stab. Left click is speedy slash, which is kind of useless. So yeah, let's not do that ever again. Uh, let's see. Boom, baby. Headshot. Boom, headshot. That's my FPS dog, if you know what that is, but from Pure Ponage, that is actually. It's a web series. But you know what? Uh, my score is only f f sinking further and further into negative territory. I'm going to blame the fact that my ping is 103. Uh, let's see. I whoa. Whoa. Was I just on blue team? Or maybe it's just me, but I could have sworn I was just on blue team. Uh, maybe. May was I on this team the all along? No way. I could have sworn I was on blue team. You know, maybe not. Apparently, my team is full of AIs, and the enemy team is full of actual players. Wow, go me, guys. Another fail moment I just had over there. Or the game just kind of switched it up. I really don't know. It just kind of happens randomly. And it's kind of hard to pay attention to things when I'm talking to you guys, but you know what? I can shoot the glass over there. Yeah, boy. The glass does break. So, uh, again, I'm going to do my random reload. And I am one kill away from being neutral. I'll, I'll take neutral, you know? I'll take what I can get. Oh, God. I'll take my neutral over there. And, oh, I'm so close to being positive, and then I died. Ugh. Oh. But again, guys, I haven't played this game for, for such a long time. I mean, the last time I played it was probably when I did my first look video or slightly after that, I played it once or twice. But this is a game I really don't play too often. But again, I like playing random FPS games, which is the reason why I'm doing this right now. And I figured I might as well record myself while I play, you know? Why not? Do it live. But the thing about doing it live sometimes, I do all my videos live, except my news videos. I think everything else I do on the spot without any practice. Because I think it's more fun that way anyway. So it's a KS Telecom, so shoot that guy, and you know what, Sandbag AI? You're done. Just own that Sandbag AI over there. I killed the one bot on their team. Well, there you go, I killed that guy there too. You know what, guys? I'm not going to talk. I'm on a killing spree right now. I'm not going to go jinx it right now. Oh man, there's a lot of dudes over there, and they all spawned, and they all have invulnerability. Why did I go there? They have That's the spot they all res in, and because of that, they had the 3 second of vulnerability once they res. Look at that rookie eye over there, just kind of camping. 
And I think my team is winning. Go. No. Ah, uh, JK, we're losing, actually. I guess it's because we have all the AIs on our team. While the enemy has players. That guy's 81 and 44. He's doing a lot better than us. But then again, he's kind of farming off the AIs. I, I can't farm the AIs so much because there are there are a lot more AIs on my team than the enemy team. Let's go run down over here. And I am... What is going on over here? Let's go shoot a nade, man. Shoot a nade. Anyway, guys, I actually am running out of time. If you guys do want to play KOS Secret Operations or just learn more about it, do check out the full review on MMOHOT.com on link below.